Dr. Dang Mun Khan. And I'm Julie. Welcome to LabTech Engineering. Here at LabTech Engineering, we are class to introduce to you our latest machine, the Mini Scientific Mail Spinning Lights. This mini lights is designed to consume minimal materials, has a small footprint, and low energy consumption. These features not only contribute to reduce environmental impacts, but also make it well suited for lab-scale experiments and research areas. This line assembly consists of an extruder, gear pump, spinneret die, quenching chamber, godets, winder, and control panel. The overall mini design is efficiently optimized for producing continuous plastic polymer fibers. The extruder is the primary unit responsible for producing uniformly homogenized polymer mills. In this setup, the extruder uses a 16 mm single screw extruder despite its mini size. The extruder maximizes the capabilities of the spinning light. It's also directly connected to the gear pumps for the precise and constant flow of the polymer melt to the spinneret die. Over here is the spinneret die responsible for extruding and shaping molten polymer into continuous filament. It is made from materials known for high thermal conductivity and wear resistance. The spinneret die used here features eight round shaped holes, but it can also be optionally customized within the range of eight to 24 holes each having a diameter of 0.3 millimeters. Right below the spinneret dies is the quenching chambers, which use the closed low fan to deliver a laminar and stable flow, effectively cooling and solidifying the molten polymer fibers. And here are two godet units utilized to draw and orient the polymer fibers after extrusion from the spinneret die. The essential function of the hot godet rollers centers in enhancing the strength, crystallinity, and uniformity of the fibers through applying a controlled amount of tension and temperature control. The next unit is the widers, which provide stable and uniform tension to the filament during widening prevent filament breakage, and produce the spool of yarns with consistent quality and size. A computerized control panel located right next to the filament working area allows easy monitoring and adjustments of various parameters during the operation, such as temperature and speed. The mini male spinning line can achieve speed of up to 1,000 meters per minute, providing a capability to produce a range of yarn type including POY, multi-filament yarns, microfiber yarns, and monofilament yarns. Additionally, this machine also versatile enough to work with various materials such as polyester, polyethylene, polypropylene, and more. Now, let us show you how this mini spinning line operates. The process begins with the introduction of solid plastic resin into the hopper which then enters the barrel. Gradual melting occurs through the combined mechanical energy from the rotating screw and heat provided by heaters arranged along the barrel. The polymer is then pressurized and conveyed by the screw towards the die, passing through a gear pump before exiting through the spinneret die. After exiting the spinneret die, the molten polymers are shaped into the contrast fibers and enters a quenching chamber. The quenching process involves rapidly cooling the fiber using cooling air. The air intensities can be adjusted according to the desired cooling rate of the materials. The quenched filaments pass through a series of free rolls towards the godet, which exerts a controlled drawing ratio on the fiber. This drawing process imparts orientation and alignment to the polymer chains, influencing the mechanical properties of the fiber product. The draw fiber are collected and glued onto a wider to create a bobbin of continuous fiber yarn. The wider speed is adjusted and controlled from the control panel to ensure the uniform formation of yarn. So there you have it, LabTech Engineering, Mini Scientific Mail Spinning Lights. We hope you found this information helpful in understanding the process and its application in the industry. Here at LabTech Engineering, we also offer a lot of machines for compounding, film extrusion, and 3D filaments. 
You can visit our website at www.labdecengineering.com for more information. And if you have any questions or need more information, please send us an email at labtech at labtechengineering.com or reach out to us on our other social media accounts on Facebook, Instagram, and LinkedIn. Thank you for watching.